The Primavera by Sandro Botticelli is a very famous work of 1481, now preserved in the Uffizi in Florence. The characters of Botticelli Primavera were first identified at the end of the 19th century. To the right is Zephyr, the spring wind, which is the nymph Chloris in low weed and who transforms into flora. The woman who wears the flowery dress and who represents spring. At the center of the painting is Venus, symbol of love and elements of nature. On the left are the three graces that dance by waving their fingers, when next is Mercury which chases away the crops not true in the spring. The Botticelli spring seems to stage characters painted in vivid and very clear colors against a dark background. The red of the robes of Mercury and Venus stands out the rest of the tones except the orange fruits of the trees and flowers below are cold and blue. Zephyr blue on the right is colored with shades of Prussian blue with turquoise lights and pink in the later parts. The foreground figures are illuminated in a frontal way, almost without shadows. They seem to emanate a clear light from their surface. The direction of illumination can be seen on the red draperies of Mercury and Venus, which are enriched with a colored shadow on the right. Zephyr on the right is the most volumetric character, painted with a drifted chiaroscuro contrast. Also, the flowers stand out against the very dark meadow and look phosphorescent. It is evident that Botticelli wanted to celebrate with Primavera an ideal of classic beauty that according to historians derives from the research of Filippo Lippi, his master. Moreover, this work includes a garden enriched by 119 different plants, of which 138 identified among trees, herbs, flowers and shrubs. The artist demonstrates not only skills but his knowledge and mastery in reproducing many plant species.